Nigeria's Super Falcons captain Asi Saad Oshoala made history when she became the first African footballer to win the UEFA Women's Champions League after her Spanish club FC Barcelona thumped Chelsea 4-0 in the finals. Now it capped yet another milestone in the decorated career of Oshoala who started out from humble beginnings at the Nigerian side FC Robo. CGTN's Deji Badmus reports. This is where it all began for Asisa at Oshola. It's a sandy beach of a local secondary school that serves as the training ground of one of Nigeria's women football clubs, FC Robo. For close to four years, Asisa trained and played here under the watchful eyes of this man who discovered her, the coach and club owner. Asisa played against us in a very secondary school game and I saw her and I saw the potential, and I developed that potential. By that time, I was not that experienced in coaching. I only believe in my own game, in my own days when I was playing, use what you have to gain position. I saw her speed, and I developed the speed. I worked all my life on the speed. From the sandy pitch of FC Robo, Asisat has now risen to become one of the top players in global women football. A milestone is becoming the first African player to win the UEFA Women Champions League with FC Barcelona. Being the first uh, African player to win the UEFA Women's Champions League means a lot to me, my career, and also other kids in Africa to make them understand that no matter um, what's going on around you, just keep pushing, just keep working, don't give up on your dreams, and you have to realize that everything is actually possible. I feel excited, at least. I, I give God the glory once again, but it's a record. Maybe in this area, we set the pace and I follow. Oshuala's story has been a source of inspiration to these young girls at FC Robo. 19-year-old gift here is the highest goal scorer in the just-concluded Nigerian Women's Football League. She's closely following in Oshuala's path to achieve her own dream. She has always been a motivator to me. Her success has always been inspiring me a lot. So. Every day I just pray to be like her, to be successful like her, and to make him like her. Having won the African Women's Footballer of the Year a record four times, and several other individual and team awards, including a national honor by the Nigerian government, one thing missing in her trophy cabinet is the World Cup. No African team has ever won the Women's Football World Cup. I believe an African team can actually win um, the World Cup, obviously, but to be honest with you, I think we are still not ready now compared to the kind of preparations and everything the European players get. But it's, it's still very much possible. But I just think we are not ready now. From this humble beginning to global stardom, Asisa to Shualat is a typical story of grass to grace. And at just 26, she's probably just getting started. Deji CGTN, Lagos, Nigeria.